Hello and welcome to another Yakuza 3 100% video guide video. And in this video we're going to talk about sub stories, specifically chapter 5, and this is going to be part 1 of chapter 5. We're going to cover Mr. Try and Hit Me Again, we're going to cover Return to the Dragon Palace, we're going to cover Kiryu the Collector, and High Tech Peeping Tom. So without further ado, let's get it on. This sub story Mr. Try and Hit Me Again can only be completed at night. Go to Shifuku parking lot east of Kanrai to find this dude challenging all corners. Kiryu has encountered this man before and managed to tag him. For 3,000 yen you'll get the opportunity of earning 50,000 yen. There's actually a really easy way to do this. Unlock the Kamaki Dodge Shot, which is on your tech list of upgrades. Quick step forward and press triangle and you'll automatic automatically track him straight into him. So it's the shoulder barge one. That's the end of Mr. Try and Hit Me Again. Next one is Return to the Dragon Palace. So for this one, you go to the question mark east of the batting center. And you'll see some punks hanging out, looking to go hunting. So they're hunting the homeless people. Head west and north towards the edge of the map and you'll see a homeless guy surrounded by punks ruin them and head back to the punks to the southeast smash all five of them and then their leader comes out he's actually pretty good so be careful with the fight after defeating all of them you'll gain access to the dragon palace shortly thereafter you'll get a phone call from the casino owner letting you know both the casino and the gambling hall are open again. Magical stuff. Yeah. 
On to the next one, Kiryu the Collector. So for Kiryu the Collector, go to Theatre Square and you'll see a debt collector chasing after his client. He recognises you from your old Dojima days and asks for your help in collecting from his client. Agree to help and he says he'll call you if, you, if he gets any info on the guy. I'm not sure if it's time or location, but for me it happened a few minutes later as I was entering Park Boulevard. So you go up north towards Park Boulevard and it should get a call. So you'll get a call and be told the guy was spotted in Park Boulevard. More specifically, he's directly north of Camry in the homeless camp. Save before you approach him, so you just go east along Park Boulevard, you'll find him. Talk to him and he'll start dodging around in battle, much like Mr. Try and Hit Me. If you have Kamaki dodge shot, quick step forward and press triangle to track him with a shoulder charge. You'll have to do this about four times before he goes down. If you get him on your first try, you'll get 100,000 yen. Every time you fail, he'll run off and you'll get less yen as you go, decreased by 20 grand every single time. He also changes locations if you have to find him again. So the second location, if you fail, is Smile Burger on Namakichi. Third location is atop the sign at the south entrance of Pink Street. Fourth location is inside Earth Angel. And final location is inside Mac Bowl. That's the end of Kiryu the Collector.
onto high tech peeping Tom. Ah, <laughs> oh, these quests, man, so good. So high tech peeping Tom, you'll have to complete. Uh, try and hit me again for this one to appear at the corner of Senryu and Taihei. A woman in shades and a purple dress will ask you to hear her out. Do so, and you'll be taken to the small lot east of the Millennium Tower. She'll want you to help her find a guy peeping on her. Use first person mode to spot any sp suspicious folks, and you can't leave the immediate area. So the first guy should be right in front of you, hanging from the ledge, wearing red underwear. He's not the guy. The second guy to spot is on top of the building to the northeast, on the very roof. He's also not the guy. <laughs> the third person is on the roof uh, to the southwest, and that'll be a woman in a skirt. She is also not the guy. Fourth person is on the northwest roof, and it'll be a woman yelling at a cat. Also not the person. And finally, the last person clinging to the wall to the west wearing grey is the guy with his high-tech peeping equipment. <laughs> Fire. So you beat up the peeper and you get 50 grand as a reward. So thank you very much for watching. And before you go, check out Cyric Z's guide. I'm reading my descriptions from Cyric Z's guide. Um, I didn't use it for all of the subquests, obviously, but for a few of them I did. And he's very useful. So if you if you learn easier by reading rather than watching, then feel free to use his guide. Uh, but if you like watching, then feel free to use my guide. So thank you very much, and peace out. Oh,
Come on.